Hi Pisces, welcome to Tarot Readings by Roxby. Hope you guys are all doing well. Pisces, those of you that have subscribed to the channel, thank you so much. I truly, deeply appreciate it. And because of that, I'm going to be going live. I'm going to start every week going live for you guys. Pisces, June 2021 for Pisces. Sun, Moon, Rising Signs. I am using Mystical Magna Tarot. An amazing deck. Pisces. Your cards are perfect. Just perfect. Magician. Seven of Wands. Queen of Swords. Ten of Swords. Nine of Swords. The Fool. The Star. Sign of Aquarius with the star strength. Right, your overall energy. Oh my god. All right. The Eight of Swords. Hold on. I'm going to get another one. All right. Six of Pentacles. Bottom of the deck, you have the Three of Wands. You know, close to reaching your ships coming in. You know, being close to reaching your goal. You know, maybe some of you, more effort is needed. You know, as long as you're willing to put the work in Pisces, work hard, you know, put energy, time, effort, you really will absolutely see results. Some of you are very close to reaching your goal, your ship's coming in. I mean, oh, interesting. You have the Ten of Wands. And the Seven of Pentacles. Well, you have worked very hard. Definitely. Seven of Pentacles. You planted those seeds. These seeds are almost full. You know, you might need a couple more that just need some time to grow. But this, it, you know, some of you, this could be within your career. Like, um, you know, you could be working. God, I really made a mess here. Sorry. Like, you could be working, you know, very hard to move up, get a new job, whatever it might be. With the Ten of Wands, it definitely it hasn't been easy for you, Pisces. Know, dealing with this this heavy load a lot of you are giving up 
Like, you're not dropping that, you know, you're not dropping this heavy load at all. You only want one, and that's a new beginning, which is after this. Just hang in there. You're very, very close to com really completing, reaching, and reaching your goal. You really are. Your overall energy is the, you know, Eight of Swords. You know, I think some of you are overthinking things, fearing the worst. You know, it comes up when you're worrying unnecessarily. Definitely worrying. I feel like some of you started something, even invested in something. You know, you're working hard. Just don't fear the worst. You, know, you have the Knight of Pentacles under there too. You know, and if, you know, Six of Pentacles is clarifying this. You definitely could be waiting on an opportunity, waiting on news. And this definitely could be financial. It could be a new job, a raise. You're, with Six of Pentacles, you're definitely being helped. Like, really, you are, you are waiting to manifest the magician. That Pisces... You already have everything you need to be successful. Whether, you know, you're willing to put the time, effort into this, you will definitely fight for what it is that you want, for whatever it is that you deserve with the Seven of Wands. You're going to fight for it. And you will, you're going to absolutely be successful. You have everything you need. The fool is you definitely moving forward. Really, literally, you're, this deck, you're starting down a new path. I'm sorry, I feel like I'm far away from you guys. I can't move this chair in. You know, you're definitely... You're doing something. You probably had to wait to be able to do to do this. Maybe some of you had a fight to actually get to this point. But by you not absolutely, by you not backing down, not giving up, not giving in, no matter how stressful things are, you're just not crashing and definitely not backing down. The magician and the fool. I mean, that is you determined to start down a new path. You know, you have the Eight of Swords, the Nine of Swords, the Ten of Swords. This that, that this energy, Eight of Swords, Ten of Swords, Nine of Swords. This energy is going to play out quickly. Definitely is going to be energy Energetically speaking, you know, those of you, if you're really in your head, stressing a lot, fearing the worst, this will is definitely going to pass qu really quickly. You know, this is not something that's going to go on. I would say like a month. This will definitely play out really fairly quickly I mean with the Queen of Swords some of you definitely could be dealing with an air sign the Libra Gemini Aquarius woman but you also have the star with that that's important yes you definitely could be dealing with this person others of you you know as you I do strongly feel like this is your energy all that mental energy is your energy with the queen of swords is sharp thorough she is fair very fair you know she's a person that could be the type of person that when 
you know, through quite a bit. And, and, and it, 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 it made her have a tougher exterior, but she's learned from her experiences. She's very wise. So if you have this person around you, she definitely could be very helpful for some of you. And for some of you, this is your energy with the star healing after everything that you've gone through. You know, I mentioned that mental energy clearing out quick. Really with strength, need, just really needing to be strong. You know, I do feel like this is something that You're going to, you're going to be strong. And I do feel like this is something I'm giving you. Is that you are strong, Pisces. Once, once you reach this goal and you achieve whatever it is you're trying to achieve, this goal is going to make you like wiser you know, this experience that you're going through with the Ten of Swords, you know, this is the worst that is behind you. You went through a difficult time. You know, whatever it is that you have gone through, it is going to make you stronger. Now is just the time for you to focus on the future. Stay optimistic about the future. You know, you are you are strong. You know, I do feel like, you know, you're going to, you're, you're going to stay strong. The magician, stay confident, believe in yourself. The star is a karmic energy. What you put out there, you really will see something amazing come back to you. You really will, Pisces. Like something amazing is coming back to you. Daily guidance from your angels. There's just no guidance. Clarification on this reading for Pisces. June 2021. Okay, well, that card went flying. <laughs> wow, shower of abundance. You know, for some of you, it is a very difficult time that you went through. It could be something job-related. It could be something financial. But you're being helped with that. Go for it. You know, this is totally, totally confirming that you're on the right path. You definitely should not give up. Pisces, you're going to be successful. This can't resonate any better. I feel like you've had to be strong. You might have even had to fight to be where you are right now. But it's confirming you're on the right path and you will be successful. I mean... This and the star alone is a total, com complete shower of abundance. Wishes and dreams coming true. I love it. That was perfect. That couldn't have been a better card. That's why I use them. Pisces, I love you guys. I am going to see you live very soon. Um, your love monthlies are right behind this. See you later. Bye.